Bueno amigos, me encuentro en estos momentos con una de las mujeres más bellas del mundo. Una de las chicas que roba el, el aliento a muchos. Wow, God, you're very nice. I think you're wasting your time with this guy. This is your second time working with Jason and with Will Smith. How was your experience? And they're just really nice guys and I think a huge part of why I wanted to do this was because of them, because they were involved and the idea of working with them again got me really excited. Uh, the big change you made from all the movies you've been doing and now you're doing a comedy and action movie. We can call it an action comedy movie. A, a movie that is many things. Yeah, I mean, I, I like that it doesn't feel like any particular genre. It doesn't feel just like a comedy or an action. I think this film really kind of covers every genre that's out there and I really like that. People don't like these movies. Mm. I look like I care what people think. We're creating a new superhero and that hasn't happened I think in over 80 years. So that by itself is really interesting. So then I think the question is, well if we're going to create a new superhero, you know, what what are the things that we miss? Like what are the things that we don't see? Like how can we make him so unusual that he's so different from any other superhero out there? And I think what we all started realizing is the more flaws he had, the more human he was, the more it became very original. The more it just kind of became like a superhero in a world that you've never seen before. And I, I think if you're going to go and create a new superhero, you should try and do something that has never been done before. So I think that's what we just tried to do. We just kept trying to go more human, more flawed. He's an alcoholic, he's depressed, he's just tired of saving people. It was like the anti-hero. She's definitely not who she seems to be and she's trying desperately to not reveal to anybody or to herself her true feelings and, and her true identity and, and so that was very interesting to play. At the end there's this big message that we all can change, we all can do better. Do you think that's what people have to take home? You know what I love about making films is that people can always walk out of a theater taking something very different than maybe what you even intended or what other people take and I think that's life. You know, I don't think story or the human condition or film is black and white and I think it's great that 200 people can sit in a dark room, watch the same movie and walk out with something differently. Uh, to everybody in Panama, I'm Charlize Theron and my new film is Hancock. Please go and watch it, you'll really enjoy it.